don't matter about what your mindset is, it's about what your habits are. If you have bad habits, if you have negative habits, if you don't have habits to help you grow, if you don't have habits, have habits that's, if you have habits that's holding you back, bro, and you're not gonna get far, even if you had the strongest mind in the world. If you're doing the, if you're still doing the wrong actions, you still can be caught up in the same cycle. Even myself, I catch myself in many cycles. So I have to catch myself doing the wrong things, doing these lustful habits. Either you're gonna be on a pur purpose or you're gonna do it for lust. But that's one thing I've been recognizing. Like either I do something on my purpose or I'm doing something for lust or for somebody, something that don't even matter. You gotta remain focused, remain on your purpose, remain on your square. Cause a lot of people not on their square. A lot of people not, you know, I'm able to say a lot of people, just a lot of people don't even understand. A lot of people not even aware. I'm not even gonna say, cause most people don't even know, you know, like, you just got to understand that everything is come with a price. Like right now, I'm just in the sun. I've been working out every day just trying to, you know, just trying to really get back in shape. Because, you know, I say spirit, mind, and body. And that body is one key part of your everything. Because what seats your soul, your body seats your soul. So I want to keep my body in shape. I want to keep my soul. I want my body to feel good. What I put it, I want to watch what I put within myself. I want to watch what I'm doing, you know. I just want to heal within. I don't want to have to, you know. I don't want to become, I don't want to go back to an old cycle. I don't want to go back to a past place of myself because you could get all the lessons. You could have, they, somebody can give you all the directions. You can still take the wrong path. So you want to make sure that you take that path. Like you got to make sure that your habits align with your goals. What are, you say you want to be a millionaire. What habits would your millionaire self, what habits would your future self that's a millionaire have? Will he be playing the game all day? Will he be smoking all day? Will he be drinking every weekend? Will he be partying every weekend? Ask yourself those deep, deep questions. Ask yourself these questions. You have to align yourself. Like manifestation is all about aligning yourself. A lot of people think that you're just going to manifest. You manifest just because you're lucky. No, you manifest what you're aligned with. If you're not aligned on a million dollars, if you're not aligned with your purpose, if you're not aligned with what you putting on this paper, on that piece of paper, on that 369, you're not going to get it. If you're not aligned with being the best version of yourself, you're not aligned with healing yourself and healing. If you're not aligned with what you say you want to manifest, you're not going to get it, basically. Like, you got to actually know what it feels like to be a content creator like me. Like, I know I'm going to be a content creator because I have been doing this for so long. I've been doing this so consistently. So I know that I'm going to be a content creator. I understand it. I've done this so long that it's to a point where it's like a habit. Like I said, your habits should align with what your purpose is going to be. My purpose is to make content. My purpose is to awake as many people as I can. Like, that's my purpose. My purpose is to just help people know who they are, you know?